Best quarterback the Bills have ever seen. Even upgraded again. F stands for fantastic. We have a fantastic grade at quarterback. Oh, hey there. Welcome to uh, Posh Nallen. Uh, and welcome back to another Madden 19 video. This is probably not going to be a series because uh, Param Crow is, you know, something similar to this. But I was suggested by uh, Jackson Scott. You should see if he can get a zero overall superstar dev player and how high of an overall in his career. Also give him like 85 speed. Otherwise they get not. Okay, I mean, I love you, bro. And you actually are pretty, you know, articulate and you're, you're good at comments. All right. But this is not your best work. All right. There's a lot of double negatives. There's. There's, I don't even know, man. I There's things just going on that I just... Thanks for the suggestion. <laughs> That's all I've got. Uh, it's a good thing that I read that because I also forgot to change his dev. And ironically, you can't do that after the fact. Can I? No, I can't. You can do everything you want when you're actually playing. But when you choose a player, you can't. Why? You know? Why? Well, here we go. We're back, and uh, we actually have Superstar Dev, which is really good. I mean, that's really nice. So this is the stat line. I, I took it a little bit further. I, you know, I changed it up a little bit. He's got a lot of zero, all right? Okay, toughness, I didn't want that at zero, but it, it, it happened, all right? It happened. Uh, 99 speed, 99 XL, 99 agility, strength, you know, injury, stamina, awareness. Everything else, not that good. So uh, maybe I should have chose a team with, you know, better weapons around in the Bills, Without Posh Nallen, probably not looking too great, you know? Just not looking too great at all. But with them, superstars. But yeah, honestly, like, you could have played with probably the Eagles, and they would do really bad, and he would probably do really bad. But let's just, you know, let's just see. Maybe maybe we can uh, get it done. Now, I don't know. I haven't actually watched Param's videos. I'm sorry, Param. I just haven't really watched much Madden YouTube at all. It's not, you know, I've watched the same amount of your videos as I've watched everyone else's. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. What I was trying to get to the point was, I don't know if he does literally until the end of their lives, but I think I'll probably do 10 seasons with this. Uh, kind of like there are little 10 season rebuild thing we have going on. Not really a rebuild at all, but holy crap. Yeah, that's that's not the stats of a zero overall. Or yeah, I guess that is stats. Ratings is what we're really looking for. So honestly, a 4-12 and 12 team, but... Not a bad quarterback performance from, once again, a 12 overall quarterback. Very interesting. Very interesting stuff. Uh, I don't really care about defensive stats. I would say that's good enough for Offensive Rookie of the Year, right? Very close, at least. It wasn't. God damn it, Baker. I hate you. So hopefully I didn't have to upgrade myself. Do you upgrade? So eight player upgrades. How much are you going to get, though? Is it going to, like, automatically change? So he has no scheme because... Well, I think the game's broken here. Or maybe they already upgraded them and they're just not showing it properly. I have no clue. I have it on auto upgrade, so he should be using them on his own. Allen apparently can't get higher. Not enough skill. Is it because he's not on awareness? You, you just can't do anything fun on this game because you, you just break the game. You know? You do something slightly out of the norm, and the game just gets shattered. I'm going to keep trying things here, okay? Stay with me. Just stay with me here. We'll we'll get to the bottom of this. Best quarterback the Bills have ever seen. Even upgraded again. F stands for fantastic. We have a fantastic grade at quarterback. So what overall is my fella here going to be? He's in the 50s, right? Okay, so now he's actually workable. I pretty much made him the worst quarterback you could be. Like, I think 60 is, like, kind of the lowest you can do. Let's sim 10 years. So, what do we have to hit to? Uh, Jesus, I don't know. 2017? 2017. 2027. That's what I meant. I know. I already know the results. It's, eh, I simmed, what? I don't know. Good. Four or five seasons. Didn't even think about it. Yeah, he's long gone. Yeah, I don't, I don't know why I didn't think that was going to happen. That was a mistake to have thought these things. Well, I uh, I stand corrected. He's not in the league anymore. Alrighty, I am back, and we went six and ten the first season. This time around, with a little bit better of an overall at quarterback, forty-seven hundred fifty-seven yards, twenty-two touchdowns, sixteen picks. Let's take a look at the awards. 
just for the quarterback. Otherwise, we'll be here all month. And I'm not a fan of being here all month. No. Still no. Okay, Baker. Love it. No playoffs again. 6-10. and 10. 67 overall now. Let's take a look at the stats. Not worried about the awards yet. Maybe at some point he can do it. He's killing it in the yards and touchdowns in all fairness. But not yet. So year two. I mean, this guy, Mr. Posh, has a chance of becoming a Hall of Famer. Just based on the stats. I know he's not winning. Not his fault, though. But he's got a shot, you know? There's, there's chances. All right. So it's the start of, what, the third season here? I think, and, uh, you know, they keep pushing my boy Nalan at the back of the list. He keeps dominating, but it is what it is. No heart stock, or heart sock. Kind of sucks because he's actually pretty damn good. <laughs> Let's put him on the trade block. Maybe they'll trade him for something worthwhile because, you know, my boy Nalan is going to be the starter. Nope. Year three, year four, whatever. Uh, seven and nine. It's getting better. I'll tell you, I'll, you know, I'll take it. Josh, no, 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 no Posh Nallen. Looking pretty good. Not a MVP worthy or even player of the year worthy yet, but he's getting close. And he's also 71 overall. We also now have the quarterback upgrade thingy. Tell you what, the damn Bills can draft some stars. They know how to draft. Damn. They know how to draft so well. And we're 5, 10, and 1. Not going so well. Things are things are starting to slow down a bit. Touchdowns completely gone. James Conner's now on the team. Yards are still pretty decent though. It's not going so well though. Another season. Another uh seven to nine. You know, we get into that spot. Can we break even? That's the question. Posh and Allen. Really damn good season. I'm gonna actually take a look at the awards and see if he won it this time. He's he had a chance. He actually had a chance this time. Uh, number five. Best QB was number two. Very close. Here we go. Nallen, 78 overall. Four and 12. So, uh, a bit of a step back here. It's almost like a 10-year rebuild sim thingy. Even though, uh, you know, no Josh Allen. <laughs> and in all fairness, um, or no Josh Allen. Well, obviously no Josh Allen. But in all fairness, we did draft, or they drafted two really good quarterbacks so that is going to impede the process a bit when, you know, you draft for need, but you don't get the speed. That actually fit really well as a metaphor, like speed as in upgrading player, you know what I mean. Alrighty, alrighty. No, Nalan was starting. It was a 79 overall. 5-11, and 11, the rest of the division's failing. We have a chance in these next few years. Come on, Nalan. You can do it, my dude. He's going to break an 80 overall in a moment. He's getting there. Look at him. He's getting there. No playoffs again. Nallen was the starter, but he keeps getting replaced, and he's not upgrading, even though he has been a superstar every season. I've Well, he hasn't. He dropped after the season, and I've I've made him better. I've fixed my boy right up. And uh, we were 7-8-1, our best season yet, so that's pretty cool. Here we go. Nalan's an 80 overall. About damn time. And they kept him as the starter. 8-8, eight eight, the best season officially, which is pretty cool. Uh, Posh Nalan, not quite off as a rookie or offensive player of the year award. We'll see if that's the case, though, because, uh, you know, we'll take a look after these messages. We're coming up on our last season, more than likely. I don't. I mean, I could go. Nah, I mean, if we made it this year or this far, we might as well go all the way. Ooh, do we, though? Because then we'll miss the ability to see his career. Now, we'll go with this last one, if he's even here still. Because if you fair, I don't even know if he'll stay. Do we at least have him till this season? Uh, and that's all I really wanted to see. I would love to go until he retires, but if he retires, then we can't see uh, his stats. So there's that. The playoffs. The perfect time to end it. Nalan, what is his dev? He dropped on a star after the season. This is the stats. Uh, probably not the greatest idea. If he has no throw power, you probably want to go short and medium anyways. You know, uh, No ability to break tackles, which proves you don't get any of that while upgrading your player. Did his awareness drop? No. He only got three throw power upgrade through nine, technically ten seasons. 
He, of course, is now 31 years old. Technically about to be 32. Let's take a look at... Um, was there a guy named Ransom? Nice. Is it Devontae? Nice, it is. Let's take a look at the team just for the hell of it. 86 overall. Not a bad team, actually. Tredavious is still balling out. Not bad. Oh, LaRoque. Or LaRoche, whatever this damn name is. Super freaking amazing. Look at him. He's actually so good. Sick. Absolutely sick. Let's take a look at the stats for the entire team. Why not? Posh Nallen, not bad at all. His career is actually pretty solid. I know it's a passing league, but he's got some good numbers. He's got Hall of Fame numbers probably, <laughs> which is crazy to say, but it's true. I think he actually has Hall of Fame numbers. We'll take a look at his actual career after this. Let's see. Can he win a playoff game? Ten seasons as a Hall of Fame player, basically. No playoff wins. Can that be possible? It isn't. Because he knocked one out. Four point win over the Browns. Moving on. Oh, my Lord. Two point win over the Texans. I'm not forced winning, kids. I'll show you. I'll show you. Win again. I'm actually going to have to be in the, the Super Bowl here. I'm actually going to have to look. I'll show you guys we didn't cheat. Obviously, I don't really know why you would care or I would care. Why anyone would care at this point. This is crazy talk. This is unbelievable. Posh Nallen's going to do it. Posh Nallen has the power behind him. 86 to 88. It's crazy. Going to go through it kind of quickly because I feel like I've been recording this video for about an hour, maybe two hours. It's kind of long for a video that I thought would have been a lot quicker than this. Half the reason is because I didn't think about it, you know? So we're down. Oh, the Bills down by three. Not bad at all. Defense must have been doing a pretty damn good job. Tied up 10 all. I like it. 13 10. And now let's go slow sim. Ooh, only up by four. Clo oh, clutch drive. Wow, and fourth and six. A touchdown to Devontae. Posh Nallen could do it. Ooh, they gave up a touchdown. Worst time for the defense to really suck. They're getting on the field. Oh, my Lord. A clutch play. And the lead has changed again. A pick. Oh, what's going on? Please don't score a touchdown. Tied up. It's going to overtime. You knew it would with Posh Nallen. But did you think you would win a Super Bowl? You didn't. Because Posh can do it, man. Posh Nallen. The greatest to ever do it. It only took him nine, ten seasons. But he's done it. He's the Super Bowl champion of the world. All righty. So the old Posh Nallens, my dude. I don't know why I got freaky there. I don't know. I just did. Kendall. Okay, cool. Come on, let's go. Come on. Let's wrap it up. Let's see how many minutes have I been recording for. Oh, God. 44. Hurry it up. Hurry it up. Posh Nallen, Super Bowl champion of the world. I'm going to have a tough time deciding on a thumbnail now. Probably. Maybe not. Nah, I will. This is going to suck. <laughs> this is really going to suck. It is what it is, though. Hopefully you guys uh, didn't enjoy this video. I mean, I hope you did, but you know what I'm saying. I'm not I'm not done yet. Posh Nallen's a god, man. I, I can't believe... Like, I had, honestly, no clue this was going to happen. This is a really good video. Like, I thought it was kind of funny... A little try hard, but I mean, that's you're going to get that with me because I'm overcompensating for being soulless. But I thought it was a great video. This is actually probably one of our best what ifs slash experiments we've ever had. So thank you, Jackson. I would like you to clean up the sentences next time. You know, there's a 42% a chance I'll put it in the video, the text wise. So you're going to, you know, I'm just saying. You're going to see what you've done. But let's take a look at my man. Ten seasons. I know it says nine-year experience, but ten technically. 83 throw power, 87, 86, 60 short. Not a bad quarterback. Oh, his confidence gives him one carrying. Wow. That's pretty impressive. That's pretty impressive. So, that's kind of weird, by the way. Uh, but let's see if we can take a look at his career. Uh, I don't know why I went all the way out for this. Let's go to... I really want to see how much uh, fumbleage has happened. So, of course, it doesn't show you in, like, statistical format that I would like to see, you know, total at the bottom. 
let's you know let's just average it out. Let's just say through every season he averaged 4,200 yards, right? So 4,200 times 10 is 42,000 yards. That's not bad. Is it Hall of Fame worthy? It might be because he won a Super Bowl. That's the he could be. He could be, and he's not done technically. Kind of, maybe. He probably would be done. So, touchdowns, I can't put a number on this. I'm going to average this thing out at about 29 touchdowns. So, 29 times 10 is 290 touchdowns. That's not bad. Picks, this is kind of rough. I'm going to average this at about... So, 290 touchdowns, 140 picks. The average completion percentage of about 65%. That's not bad. You know, that's not bad at all. So zero carrying. He never fumbled once in his career. That's insane. All right. Good job, man. I mean, this was a great video. I thought if you hated the video, well, it's the best it's going to get. So you might as well never come back. Please come back, even though it's going to be worse and you know it will be. I need you. All right. Stay. Thanks once again, Jackson Scott. Hopefully, uh, you know, you guys enjoy the video. If you have any suggestions for videos, let me know. I don't really want to do this as a full series because this would literally be like the the villain version of Param Crow's videos. He does uh, well. He I think I think he's doing it as a series. I would assume he's been doing like a a ninety nine overall superstar career follow thing. So there's that. And I probably should ask them to do if I could do this video, but I didn't plan it as a series. So I feel like just mentioning his channel a few times is is fair enough. You know, at least I'm giving him credit. Uh, and it is technically a completely different idea. You know, I had the whole 10-year sim for franchise ideas, which isn't the same. But, you know, whatever. Whatever, okay? Enjoy both of our videos, okay? Please. Thank you. <laughs> but, yeah, I unless this is insane viewage, which I really kind of hope it doesn't get because I don't want to feel like I just completely ripped off Param because he's such a cool dude. But if it does get insane views, I kind of might have to keep doing it. If he says it's all right, but uh, yeah, it could just be a one-off and you know, once again, let me know any ideas you have. I would appreciate them, but until you know, come back for next video, which will be a bears video, but until next video, see ya.